Today, we're taking a look at the most mysterious places scientists still can't explain. But yeah, go ahead, comment down below a mysterious place. And yeah, if you guys enjoy the video, go ahead, give it a like. It'll really help out the channel. Let's get it. Most terrifying places on Earth. Who's that in the background? A Jehovah's Witness? Oh, wait, what? Bielitz Heidenstaden Hospital in Germany? Look at this thing. This looks like a place where they perform like uh, illegal experiments. Oh, no, no, no. Somebody needs to clean this up. Where's the janitor at? You got gas masks hanging from the ceiling. This is a, a creepy abandoned building. And then you got another one up in the Ukraine. Oh my gosh. The bumper cars are abandoned. Oh no, boy. Wow. Door to Hades. Oh, my, why? Why? Why are you standing there? That's not the place to go for a date. Are you kidding me? This is one of the most haunted places in the entire world. This is Eastern State Penitentiary in North America, and this prison was in use in the late 1800s. So over a hundred years ago this prison was. Dang. People died in this prison because it was such a brutal prison where inmates were literally tortured. You can still visit this place and actually stay the night there if you dare. People who have stayed there have reported seeing and hearing horrific things during the night, such as screams and banging and even people which sound like they're going absolutely crazy. Not today, Satan. You ain't about to get me, boy. But for real, your hair and that microphone got the same dang haircut. <laughs> I got him. I'm just kidding. But what's going on? Was the barbershop having a buy one haircut, get the other one free? <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. Scariest places on there. What the? Bro, glasses over your hoodie. What? Anyway. Oh. It's like an island of crosses. Oh my gosh. This is the place where you need to perform an exorcism. I mean, wow. Get the holy water. This was captured during my Facebook Live last September 2019. Listen carefully, you'll hear them screaming. Should we go away when done? Do you think it would be safe if we held on? I don't hear anything. Uh -oh. oh! I'm sure this is not what they had in mind when their family said, Hey, we're going on vacation. What is this, man? Going to a dang demon parking garage. Get up on out of here. The most beautiful places on earth. Oh, here we go, finally. All right, all right, we're good, we're good. We're chilling. What do we got? Whoa, uh Finland. Wait, guys, uh, how do you pronounce that? Seljalansafoss, Iceland. Okay, guys, I'm going to Iceland. Is that girl there? Is she over there in Iceland? I'm about to book me a flight right now. Wow, uh, Bora Bora, ooh. Canada, I'll, I'll go. The Philippines, Ireland. Everybody's got like such nice like ocean waters over there, wow. The most mysterious places on earth. The Bermuda Triangle, located between Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico. More than 20 planes and 50 ships crashed there without any reasonable explanation. That's not good, man. I mean, it could be like, you know, bad weather, bad storms or something, or there could be uh, something illegal going on, or something like, you know, demons. Some even disappear completely. Wow, some theories even include aliens. <gasps> Guys, would you go investigate the Bermuda Triangle? Like, just comment down below. Not me, not today, Satan. The scariest place on Earth. <laughs> Anywhere with you? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <gasps> The Bell Witch Cave is located on a farm that belonged to the Bell family in 1870. Ew! Looking like a dang Sam and Colby video. Oh my gosh. That's scary. The Bells were tormented by an evil witch who supposedly lived in the cave. Oh wow. The family saw strange animals and heard terrifying noises throughout their home. Are you kidding me? Y'all need to move, okay? Move to Afghanistan. Jeez. These Black are the man. most dangerous places on earth. Listen, do not share this video. I won't. Or the government's gonna deport me back to Chuck E. Cheese. A lot of people ask me, Mr. Hat, where do you live? That's a really good question. I said way too much, but anywho, we got our first dangerous place, which is Snake Island. Oh. It's in the coast of Brazil, and of course, it got snakes. Now, you have to be a Betty boy to go to this island, unless if you like Orochimaru. Like, second, we have Death Valley. This place is in Nevada, and it's dangerous because it gets hot. Okay. Like it gets so hot, you might think it's Antarctica. Last, we have Willy Wonka's Chocolate Factory. 
um, excuse my emotionality, but my cousin went there and got turned into a Hershey bar. <laughs> he tastes good, but <laughs> he ate it. Oh, you're horrible, black man. You're horrible. Creepiest places on earth. All right, let's see it. Villisca Axe Murder House. Georgia's Church. What is this? Why do y'all got on some dang blankets over your faces? Y'all need to fix that roof, okay? I mean, if it rains there, y'all are screwed. It's gonna be leaking all over the place. Dang. Hanging coffins. Are you kidding me? Hanging coffins on the side of a mountain. Island of dolls. Oh no. That's crazy, man. Island of dolls. I ain't about to do it. Not to do it. Oh! Okay, that didn't get me, guys. That didn't get me. I was like, I, I had to sneeze. So I was like, ah, chew. Yeah, anyway. Places on earth that actually exist. Oh, Hitachi Seaside Park. Bamboo Fort. These are nice. Ooh, the ice caves. Ooh, Red Beach. Okay, guys, comment down below. Which one of these places would you visit if you had to pick one? Hitachi Seaside Park or the Bamboo Forest or the ice caves or Red Beach? Reasons why the ocean is one of the scariest places on Earth. Because we've only discovered like 10% of it. <gasps> Footage of an extremely large squid. What? That's a squid? That's an alien. Are you kidding me? Guys, I've seen SpongeBob. Squidward ain't that dang big. Are you kidding me? Wow. That thing looks like it's interrupting a news broadcast to reveal his evil plans to take over the world. The most scary places on earth. Okay, show me what you got. That's what she said. Asylum, oh, doll island, classroom, <laughs> what? Statue of people playing in Russia, oh wow. A cave that has skulls just like, you know, uh, mounted in the wall, wow. Mysterious places on earth. Part one, mm. this is North Sentinel Island. And what makes this island different from other islands is the fact that Sentinese people have been isolated for nearly 60,000 years. Wow. Due to their disconnectedness from the rest of the world, their rituals and way of life are unknown. Any unexpected visitors in the past have either been shot with arrows or killed, making this one of the most mysterious yet dangerous places on earth. That's scary, man. So there's still like an island that's hostile to like anybody who's like sailing by. Wow, North Sentinel Island, not yet. I'm marking that off of my uh, list of vacation spots. Here is the creepiest place on earth. The Island of Dead Dolls is located on the canals of Mexico City. It has widely been deemed one of the most haunted places on earth. Why? 1500 dolls hung on trees. The story goes a Mexican man was traveling on the canals when he found a dead girl next to the banks of a river. The man found a doll next to her and pinned it on a tree out of respect for the little girl. When he got home, he heard voices of spirits beckoning him to come back to the island with more dolls. The man then spent the rest of his life, 50 years, bringing 1,500 dolls to the island. The man died in 2001, but he left behind an island that's visited by thousands of tourists each year. So what do you think? Would you go to this island? Do I look like I would go to this island? <laughs> no, I wouldn't. But comment down below, would you go? What's up? This What's is up, some Brody? of the most terrifying places on earth. Part two. All right, so first place on our list is gonna be Ed Gein's home in Wisconsin. Ed Gein was a notorious serial killer back in the 40s and 50s who allegedly butchered his victims, cut off their skin, and used it for suits, masks, and even lampshade. The reason why this is so terrifying is because all the tools and utilities that he used to cut off their skin are still lying in the house today. That's terrifying. All right, next place on our list is gonna be Nagoro Village in Japan. Nagoro is a tiny village in Japan with 375 life-size dolls and 27 breeding humans. Just imagine you're in a random part of the world and you're living by yourself, but the only catch is you're living with 300 dolls that can't even talk to you. That's horrific. All right, next place on our list is going to be the door to hell in Turkmenistan. It's a 235 foot wide crater that won't stop burning. Back in 1971, scientists were drilling a hole and it caused an explosion, creating this landmark. If you ever wonder what the gate to hell looks like, here's your shot. Last one on our list is going to be Snake Island in Brazil. Snake Island is known as one of the most dangerous islands in the world, from falling out of trees to walking five feet and hitting a viper. If you're afraid of snakes just like I am, I suggest not going to this island because it's terrifying. Dang, Will Wharton. You know what I got out of all that is that this dude needs to cut his hair ASAP, all right, man? It's getting too long, bro. It's getting too long. That's what she said. All right. Most dangerous places on earth, North Sentinel Island. This place is home to the Sentinelese, one of the last tribal people to remain isolated from the modern world. There is estimated to be anywhere between 15 to 500 members and they are not 
friendly to outsiders. Once, two men were illegally fishing in the waters surrounding the island. They both got really drunk and fell asleep on their boat, which washed ashore in the night. The tribe attacked the two men with bows and spears, killing them both. Recently, missionary John Allen Chow hired a fisherman to smuggle him onto the island in hopes of converting the tribe to Christianity. He wrote in his journal, I don't want to die. Would it be wiser to leave and let someone else continue? No, I don't think so. Unfortunately, the next day, John was believed to have been hit by a volley of arrows and killed. His body has still not been recovered and is believed to have been buried on the island. Ooh, dang man, that's trippy. So yeah, uh, definitely not going to that island. Or just throw a grenade and call it a day. No. Did you know there are six to seven million people buried under Paris, France? The catacombs are about 200 miles long and is there because cemeteries were running out of room hundreds of years ago. People have even gone exploring and never come up. Wait, 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 why'd you cut it off? Dang it. Oh, James. What was he gonna say? Oh, I guess we'll never know. Dang. But yeah, go ahead, click on the screen and watch another one. Yeah, man.